Hello, welcome to jdeveloper02pro.com. This is Hassan Mir. In this tutorial, I'm going to talk about another refactoring technique uh, called extracting interfaces. So on the screen, you're looking at a class. So let's say we have a class created in jdeveloper. Let's call it class 1. And classes have methods and fields. So let's say this class has two methods, method 1 and method 2, and this class has two fields, field 1 and field 2. So what we want to do is we want to extract interface out of this class. So this class would be imp implementing some interface. So you can tell JDeveloper that you want to extract an interface and JDeveloper will give you a list of all the methods and fields of the class. So you pick which methods and fields would be part of the interface. Okay. So let's say you chose that method 1 and field 1 would be part of an interface. So this class is basically implementing this interface. So interface is simply a list of methods and fields that a class should have if the class is implementing that interface. Okay. Uh, so this way you create uh, a parent for this class that any class implementing that interface should have method 1 and field 1. Other than that, the classes could have uh, more uh, other methods than field 1 and other fields, uh, sorry, other methods than method 1 and other fields as field 1 as well. Okay, So now we have class 1 implementing this interface and later on if you want you can create sibling classes of class 1. For example, you could create class 2 and class 2 uh, would let's say also implementing the same interface. Now having said that class 2 should have method 1 and field 1 in it other than method 1 and field 1 class 2 could have its own methods and field as well for example method 3 and field 4 so both of these classes are implementing this interface so that means both of these classes should have th method 1 and field 1 so this is uh, uh, like creating interfaces is a method of enforcing selected methods and fields uh, onto the classes Okay, so now JDeveloper gives you a facility that you create a class first and then extract interface out of that class as a parent uh, entity. Okay, so let me show you an example. So this is what we created in the last few tutorials. We, crea uh, we created a class friend and this class has method uh, say hello. Okay, so this is a class and it has method uh, say hello and we have a main method as well which is basically creating an uh, object uh, from this class friend Steve and we are calling that uh, method for Steve Steve dot say hello so what we want to do is we want to create uh, extract an interface out of this friend class so what we are going to do is we are going to right click here and we are going to say refactor and we want to say extract interface now JDeveloper has basically given you the list of all the methods available in this class. So we have only one method so we are saying that yes we want to have this method uh, part of the interface. So let's say we created some higher uh, entity than friend, let's say contact. So we go, uh, in the, the name of the interface would be let's say int for interface and contact. So friend is implementing the interface contact. So friend should have a method say hello, and we can create more classes implementing the uh, the interface contact. And let's say we can create coworker class and acquaintance class, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So uh, I'm gonna click OK. So before I click OK, just remember refactoring is a technique that would basically. Uh, make changes to your code such that the functionality remains unchanged. So if you run this program after refactoring the program should produce the same output. Okay, So it just organizes your code in the way you want it of course uh, for a better. So I'm gonna click OK here. As soon as I click OK you can see uh, an interface contact has been created and we have uh, this method listed here so that means if a class is implementing this interface it should have a method say hello and of course class should be able to 
uh, implement that method in uh, in the way the class wants so each class can implement say hello in, in a different way so let me go to friend dot java so this is interface contact dot java is that simply uh, a way this interface is uh, stored now let me click on friend dot java to see the actual uh, friend uh, class here and you see public class friend implements interface contact this keyword these keywords have been inserted here by uh, by J developers so if I run this program by clicking on this run button the output should be exactly same zero hello Larry one hello Larry and two hello Larry okay so uh, this is another way you can use J developer